Hi, I'm Tony. This is Breast Cancer Straight Talk with Tony. Um, I'm recording this video today because I started a new drug last night. So I want to talk a little bit about that. Uh, I was diagnosed a year ago, April, so April 2017, with invasive ductal carcinoma, locally advanced, um, stage 3, grade 3. I had... Uh, Six rounds of FECV chemotherapy, 16 rounds of radiation, full right radical mastectomy, and um, her, a year of Herceptin treatments every three weeks. And now I'm attempting, oh, I, I'm still having Herceptin until um, June. I have two left. Woohoo! Um, now I'm attempting uh, to find a hormone blocking drug that will work for me. So I've had two attempts with tamoxifen. Uh, the first attempt, both attempts, I suffered the rare and serious side effects. Um, the first attempt, it um, got a lot worse than the second attempt. Um, I had a lot of body pain, joint, musculoskeletal pain, so muscles, bones, and joints. Um, I became less and less motivated um, to do anything. Whereas I had been very motivated, quite excited about, oh, I'm feeling better, I'm recovering, I'm going to work hard, I'm going to um, get my health back. Um, it got to the point where I uh, started having very, very dark thoughts, which is completely uncharacteristic of me. Um, and then I, it culminated in an episode where um, I forced myself out for a short walk. And as I was walking, I felt as though I were floating up here um, above myself and realized I was having the thought to, uh, that if I just step out in front of that car, this will all be over and oh my gosh, what a relief it will be. So I freaked out, um, went home and quickly, <laughs> quickly as I could. <laughs> and Mark, uh, my husband, boyfriend, husband, 11 years we've been together. So husband, I guess. Um, he said, oh, it's the drug, it's the drug, stop taking, stop taking the drug. Um, second attempt, uh, oh, of course I was afraid to stop taking the drug because, uh, well, my gosh, the cancer's going to get me if I don't take the drug. Um, so my oncologist advised me to go off it for 30 days and then try to restart it because the effects might not come back. So I did that. So back on it after 30 days and, um, Sure enough, the effects came back. This time it didn't go as far because I knew what to watch out for. So off the tamoxifen again. Um, I've been off it for six weeks now. So we're, this has been four months of uh, trying to find something. So we've moved on to the aromatase inhibitors and letrozole is the first one. Um, as I said, I've been off tamoxifen for six weeks. And it's only been really in the last week that I feel super, super good. Um, I've been feeling like the pain in my joints is, is fading each day. It's a little bit less. Um, what I would, how I would characterize that would be that it feels more dull each day. Um, so now I started the new drug last night. And as I said, it's letrozole. And I'm going to make a video each day. And uh, I'm doing this kind of for myself. Um, and maybe if I post it on YouTube, it could help somebody. Um, but I want to see for myself uh, the effect that it has. And I have a really hard time discerning that when I'm in the middle of it. Because one of the effects on the tamoxifen was that my thoughts became very, very disconnected. Um, I couldn't focus on anything. And I couldn't make sense of anything. So in the middle of that it's very hard to say, oh, I'm not myself. <laughs> so I'm hoping that if I make videos, it will help me to do that. Um, last night I took the first pill. Um, it's a two milligram pill, uh, two, two, point, two and a half milligrams. And um, I don't think I had any effects immediately. Uh, I did wake up in the middle of the night. I took it at about eight o'clock, went to bed at 10. I woke up in the middle of the night and had to go to the washroom and I had a very hard time getting up the stairs. Um, both my knees were very, very painful and my feet um, and my femur, both of my femurs had on right and left side uh, were kind of um, dull throb. 
So I've been up and about now for a few hours and uh, I was pretty stiff when I first got off, but I'm, I'm feeling not too bad now. Although I do think my legs are weaker than they were. So this is day one, um, having taken the pill last night and let's just see how it goes this time. I'm hoping for the best because without any hormone blocking drugs, there's a 50% chance that the cancer will come back. So that's not really a very great thing. <laughs> All right. So see you tomorrow.